fellow scholars, it's Miss Rogers from Cicero Athenaeum, and today we're going to be learning a little bit about popcorn. So first, I have a question for you. What's your favorite snack? My favorite snack is chips and salsa. I love to eat it when I'm watching TV on the couch or before meals if I need something to eat. One of the most favorite snacks for many people is popcorn. Have you ever wondered why popcorn pops? Does all corn pop? This is something I've been wondering about. So I have some popcorn kernels here today to help us with our lesson. Popcorn is the only type of corn that pops. It is a form of maize called Ze maize verta, but this strain has over 100 varieties for you to sample and enjoy. These hard little kernels that I have here have a very special structure that makes them poppable. I'll show you one now. They're very small, so we'll have to hold it up very closely to the camera. Inside each of these kernels is a tiny drop of water surrounded by a hard shell called a hole. What do you know about water? What happens to water when it's heated? When these kernels of popcorn are heated, the water inside turns to stream, which builds pressure inside the kernel, just like a tea kettle when it begins to whistle. When the hole can't take any more of the pressure, then pop, a new piece of popcorn is born. And it doesn't have to wait long to be joined by many friends as each of these kernels burst into life and your mouth begins to water as the air fills with the smell of that delicious snack. We Americans eat the popcorn in the world. We eat the most popcorn in the world and grow the most popcorn too. But archaeologists have found evidence that popcorn has been enjoyed for thousands of years, finding popcorn in caves in Mexico that dates back to 3,600 years BC. Wow, that is some old popcorn. I wonder if they can make that old popcorn pop. What do you think? Tell me in the comments below. How do you like to eat your popcorn? I like mine with cheese and butter. Hello all my friends, it's Miss Lashin. Um, I hope you're all doing great at home right now. I miss you all so, so, so much. But today I'm gonna teach you guys all a little song so you can show your family, your friends, and hopefully when I see you guys all again, we can do it all together. So today I'm gonna be showing you guys how to do a chanting song and it's gonna start off really, really quiet and then it's gonna get slightly louder, and then the last part is gonna get super duper loud. So you gotta jump up and do as many mo motions as you can. And you're gonna repeat each line two times. So the first line is, first you pour the corn, pour, pour the corn, first you pour the corn, pour, pour the corn, and you have to make sure that you're pouring the corn. And the second line, remember you're gonna say it twice, then you husk, the corn, husk, husk the corn, and then you husk the corn, husk, husk the corn, and remember to husk your corn. <laughs> and then the third line is, then you pop the corn, pop, pop the corn, and then you pop the corn, pop, pop the corn. And remember, you can also hop up and down while you're doing this to make it even more fun. The second part to the song goes, and then you form potatoes, form, form, potatoes, then you form potatoes, form, form, potatoes. The second part, then you slice potatoes, slice, slice, potatoes, then you slice potatoes, slice, slice, potatoes. That's my attempt at slicing, but hopefully you guys can do it better than me. And then the last part, remember, you have to get loud. Then you mash potatoes, mash, mash potatoes, then you mash potatoes, mash, mash potatoes. And finally, the last part of the song. And then you form bananas, form, form bananas, then you form bananas, form, form bananas, then you peel bananas, peel, peel bananas, then you peel bananas, peel, peel bananas. And then the last part, like I said, you've got to be crazy. Then you go bananas, go, go bananas, then you go bananas, go, go bananas. Okay, my friends, now we're gonna do it all together. Ready? Go. <laughs> First you pour the corn. 
Pour, pour the corn. First you pour the corn. Pour, pour the corn, and then you husk the corn. Husk, husk the corn, then you husk the corn. Husk, husk the corn, and then you pop the corn. Pop, pop the corn, then you pop the corn. Pop, pop the corn, and you form potatoes. Form, form potatoes, then you form potatoes. Form, form potatoes, then you slice potatoes. Slice, slice potatoes, then you slice potatoes. Slice, slice potatoes, then you mash potatoes. Mash, mash potatoes, then you mash potatoes. Mash, mash potatoes. <laughs> and then you form bananas. Form, form bananas, and you form bananas. Form, form bananas, and you peel bananas. Peel, peel bananas, and you peel bananas. Peel, peel bananas, and you go bananas. Go, go bananas, then you go bananas. Go, go bananas. <laughs> Well, my friends, I had a lot of fun putting that together for you guys, and I hope that you have a lot of fun doing it at home with your brothers, your sisters, your friends, and your family. I hope everyone's doing great, and I really, really hope to see you soon. Bye, guys. Thanks again. Hey, friends. So today I'm going to be sharing a poem that celebrates the fun and tasty snack. It's called Popcorn by Eveline Stein. Pop, pop, poppity pop. Shake and rattle, rattle and shake, the golden grains as they bounce and break, to fluffy puffiness, poppity pop, bursting and banging the popper's top, poppity pop, 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 the yellow kernels, oh, see them grow, white as cotton or flakes of snow, pop, pop, oh, ho, how they frolic and fly about, and turn themselves suddenly inside out, pop, pop, poppity pop, 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 the popper's full and will have to stop, Pile the bowl with a tempting treat. Children come, it's time to eat. I'd love to hear from all of you and your favorite snacks and how you enjoyed them. Tell me in the comments down below. Happy snacking. I miss you all. See you hopefully soon. Bye.